So what does a composter do? Well, we will show you. So a composter, basically, what it does is when you put a certain amount of organic, natural, uh, plant-based things into it, it gives you bone meal in return. So let's go ahead and get a uh, little carrots. And you just right click on it and it starts to fill it up. And certain uh, vegetable like base things have a greater chance of increasing it. So seeds don't do too well, but like wheat is pretty high and carrots are decently high, things like that. And once it turns white like that, you can right click on it and you get bone meal. Now the efficient way to use this, of course, is in the automatic machine, which we're going to do really quickly. Because this really is the only way to use it because it's just much better. So you do is you get your chest. Maybe you put it in the ground like this. With two chests. Put a hopper on it. Put the composter on it. Another hopper. And another chest. Now suppose you have like a bunch of unused annoying seeds everywhere. Just throw them into the chest and walk away. Just walk away. And look, it'll do it for you, instead of you having to do it. You can go about your business doing whatever you're doing and come back later and say, Oh, there's some bone meal already. So like I said, wheat works a lot better. Oh, it'll take a little while to get through all that. And maybe I should look up real quick so I can tell you all the different things that fit in there. One sec. All right, this is a big list. You ready? Okay. Um, I'm going to hit my inventory real quick and I'll just tell you what I see. So at the 30% chance... Uh, that thing's getting loud. Let me move away. Okay. Alright. So at the 30% chance is the beetroot seeds, dried kelp, grass, kelp, leaves, melon seeds, netherwort, pumpkin seeds, saplings, seagrass, sweet berries, wheat seeds. Uh, and then in the new 1.7 update, it should be moss carpet, hanging roots, small drip leaf, glow berries, and uh, if you're in bedrock, then you get grass block. Uh, at 50% is cactus, dried kelp block, melon slice, sugar king, tall grass, vines, weeping vines, twisting vines, and other sprouts, and potentially in 1.17 update, flowering azale leaves. At 65% is apple, beetroot, carrot, cocoa beans, ferns, flowers, lily pad, melon, mushrooms, mushroom stem, potato, pumpkins, sea pickle, shroom light, wheat, fungi, roots. And 1.17 will be spore blossom, azalea, moss block, and drip, big drip leaf. 85% is baked potato, bread, cookie, hay bale, mushroom blocks, nether wart block, warped wart block, and 1.17 flower azalea. At the 100%, works 100% of the time, cake and pumpkin pie. Okay, yeah. So I was just reading that from a list. But now you've seen all of them. And, you know, I'll put all that stuff in the description below too so you can just read it. Because it's kind of annoying to sit there and just listen to me say it, right? You just want to look quickly. So yeah, I'll just put that those in the description below so you can read them real quick. Okay, so that's the composter. That's how it works. It's great. You get bone meal out of it. And it's a good way to get rid of some of that waste. You know, like seeds and stuff that just you don't need any more of. You know, just throw them in there and get some bone meal out of it, right? It's great. I like to use composter mostly for getting the bone meal to make uh, white dye so that I can make a bunch of white concrete. Okay, well anyways, that's the composter and that is what it does.